AI-generated content and the role of ChatGPT and Google's BERT. In the past few years, the development of AI technology has allowed the creation of realistic and high-quality AI-generated content. Among the most popular models used for this purpose are ChatGPT and Google's BERT. These two models have some similarities in terms of their functionality, but they also have key differences that set them apart from each other. ChatGPT is a brainchild of OpenAI that leverages the technique of generative pre-training to create conversational AI models. This means that it trains a neural network on a large volume of data to make it capable of generating natural-sounding language. However, unlike Google's BERT, which uses natural language processing, ChatGPT relies on pre-existing data from pre-training sources to generate its responses. In contrast, Google's BERT is designed specifically for conversation and uses a different approach called question-answering models for natural language processing. This model has the ability to interpret the true purpose of the user's request and use high-level concepts to craft its responses. BERT is also capable of gathering real-time data from the internet and adapt its responses to the latest trends. The main advantage of Google's BERT over ChatGPT is its ability to provide more realistic and less ambiguous responses. BERT has been specifically designed for open-ended discussions, making its responses almost indistinguishable from human speech. Additionally, BERT provides users with a user-friendly interface, enabling them to edit their questions and receive multiple responses. However, ChatGPT still has its appeal as it is better suited for text-based tasks, like generating articles or content marketing concepts. While it may not provide the most accurate or clear responses at times, it can still be utilized for certain purposes. In conclusion, understanding the differences between ChatGPT and Google Google's BERT can help businesses and individuals make an informed choice when deciding which model to use for their AI-generated content. Both models have their advantages and disadvantages, and ultimately the choice will depend on the specific needs of the user. Nevertheless, it's important to understand that we are still in the early stages of AI-generated content and the capabilities of these models will continue to evolve in the years to come. Chat GPT, Generative Pre-Training and Applications One of the most exciting developments in the world of AI-generated content is ChatGPT. ChatGPT is a generative pre-training model that allows users to create custom responses to prompts and queries. This model is designed to learn from large amounts of data and generate answers that are consistent with the context and messaging of the prompt. ChatGPT is an excellent tool for automating tasks that require generating text, such as creating articles, generating email responses, and brainstorming ideas for social media and content marketing. The system can also be used to provide immediate and accurate responses to customer inquiries 24-7, improving user experience while also freeing up valuable human resources. The primary advantage of ChatGPT is its ability to provide custom responses and solutions that are not present in predefined templates. It uses natural language processing to understand the context of the prompt and generate answers that are consistent with the messaging and tone of the original text. This makes ChatGPT an ideal tool for generating creative content and brainstorming ideas. One of the most exciting applications of ChatGPT is in the field of content marketing. By using the model to generate customized and creative responses to prompts, businesses can streamline their content creation process while producing high-quality content that resonates with their audience. However, ChatGPT is not without its limitations. The model is primarily suited for text-based tasks and may provide unclear or inaccurate explanations when working with complex data sets. Additionally, the system may not always be able to provide the most precise answers given its reliance on pre-trained data sources. Despite these limitations, ChatGPT is an exciting development in the field of AI-generated content. Its potential applications are limitless, and the technology is only expected to improve with time. As we continue to explore the possibilities of generative pre-training models like ChatGPT, we will undoubtedly uncover new and innovative ways to leverage AI in content creation and content marketing. Google's BERT, Natural Language Processing and Benefits Google's bidirectional encoder representations from Transformers, or BERT for short, is a deep learning algorithm that is specifically designed 
designed for natural language processing NLP. This model was developed by Google AI language team and was released in late 2018. Since then, it has revolutionized the way search engines work and has enabled Google to deliver better and more relevant search results. One of the key benefits of BERT is its ability to understand the context of words in a sentence. This is particularly important in NLP because words can have different meanings depending on the context in which they are used. This enables BERT to look at entire phrases rather than individual words in a sentence, which results in a better understanding of user intent. Another advantage of BERT is its ability to gather real-time data from the internet. This means that the algorithm can update its models on the fly to reflect changes in language and trends. This results in more accurate and relevant search results, regardless of the language or location of the user. BERT's ability to process language with a higher level of abstraction is another significant benefit. This enables the algorithm to understand high-level concepts and subjects, which allows it to provide more natural-sounding and comprehensive responses. It also enables BERT to provide more relevant information, even when the user's query is ambiguous or incomplete. The user interface of BERT is also worth mentioning. It allows users to edit their questions and receive multiple responses, providing a more conversational experience. This not only improves user satisfaction, but also helps Google to better understand natural language, which improves its overall ability to deliver relevant search results. In addition to search engines, BERT has applications in several other areas, including chatbots, virtual assistants, and translation services. It has already been integrated into Google Assistant, where it has significantly improved the accuracy of spoken language recognition and query understanding. In summary, Google's BERT is a deep learning algorithm that is specifically designed for natural language processing. It has several advantages over other AI models, including its ability to understand the context of words, gather real-time data from the internet, and understand high-level subjects and concepts. Its user-friendly interface and applicability in various areas make it a game-changer in the world of AI-generated content. Comparison and contrast of ChatGPT and Google's BERT The rise of AI-generated content has spawned many new developments in the field of natural language processing. ChatGPT and Google's BERT are two of the most popular models which have generated significant buzz in the field of AI-generated content. Although both systems have some similarities, they are different in terms of their data sources, models, and applications. In this section, we will discuss the similarities and differences between ChatGPT and Google's BERT. Data Sources One of the main differences between ChatGPT and Google's BERT is their data sources. ChatGPT was trained using generative pre-training, which means it was pre-trained on a large data set of text data. This pre-training allows the model to generate a large volume of text in various styles and tones. In contrast, Google's BERT was trained for conversation and uses natural language processing, which which enables it to understand the natural language queries added by users in real-time and generate real-time results. Models Another difference is the way these models function. ChatGPT is based on artificial neural networks, mainly transformer networks. In comparison, Google's BERT was created based on the transformer architecture, which can differentiate between the preceding and following text in a sentence. It also can memorize terms in the sentence, which helps it provide more relevant search results. Google's BERT uses the method of extracting data from the web for natural language processing, which is an excellent advantage over ChatGPT. Applications ChatGPT is an ideal model for creating text-based content such as articles, emails, and coming up with marketing content ideas. However, it may provide unclear explanations, and its accuracy is not always guaranteed. ChatGPT can malfunction, and users need to be patient as it can take a while to generate output. Google's BERT is designed for more open-ended and genuine conversations with people. It reads the user's request and uses high-level concepts and subjects in decision-making processing leading to more realistic responses that closely mimic human speech. In addition, Google's BERT provides a user-friendly interface that allows users to edit their questions and select the most suitable response from a list of provided results. Similarities and differences Although both models have marked differences, they also share some similarities. Both models utilize machine learning techniques, and their architecture is based on the transformer approach. However, the outcome of the model depends on its source and training method. ChatGPT can deal 
deal with structured text data. In contrast, Google's BERT can handle unstructured data. While ChatGPT struggles to use live data, Google's BERT excels in processing real-time queries from the internet. Another significant difference between the two models is the number of training steps taken. ChatGPT requires a more extended pre-training process of 40 gigabytes, whereas BERT requires a smaller amount of pre-training with 16 gigabytes. ChatGPT also uses a more extensive range of data for pre-training, including books, web pages, and abstracts on Wikipedia, while BERT is trained on the book's corpus and a subset of English Wikipedia. Conclusion In conclusion, both ChatGPT and Google's BERT are powerful models for natural language processing applications. Each model has its unique features, including their data sources, models, and applications. ChatGPT is an effective tool mainly used for creating text-based content, while Google's BERT is designed for more conversational purposes. It is too soon to determine which of these models is superior, but with further advancements, it is possible that one model may rise above the other. Future implications The use of AI in generating content has grown significantly in recent years, with ChatGPT and Google's BERT being at the forefront of the conversation. These models have brought tremendous benefits to their users, and their differences have provided different advantages in various contexts. For ChatGPT, the use cases have been primarily focused on text-based tasks such as email writing and content marketing concepts. The generative pre-training approach employed by ChatGPT has made it easier for users to produce content without extensive prior knowledge in the areas of interest. However, its limitations in providing accurate information, unclear explanations, and a long waiting list for its full capabilities should not be ignored. Despite its limitations, ChatGPT has been beneficial in various applications, and its uses will continue to grow as more individuals and organizations seek the benefits of AI-generated content. On the other hand, BERT has been designed for conversation and uses now natural language processing to provide users with a more realistic and genuine discussion experience. It provides real-time information from the internet and applies high-level concepts and subjects to the decision-making process, making it nearly impossible to distinguish its responses from human speech. Additionally, its user-friendly interface allows for easy editing of questions and reception of several responses. This makes BERT ideal for open-ended and interactive discussions. Looking forward, it's expected that both ChatGPT and BERT will continue to grow and improve their systems to provide the best user experience. These models' advancements will lead to increased accuracy and enhanced capabilities, leading to their integration into various applications and systems. The successful integration of BERT into Google Search Engine and Bing's integration of modified GPT-4 model are an indication of this growth. In conclusion, the use of AI-generated content models such as ChatGPT and BERT is revolutionizing the way text-based tasks and conversations are done. Their differences in data sources, output, and intended use have provided various advantages in different contexts. As these models continue to grow and enhance their capabilities, they will create more significant impacts in various industries and applications. The future of AI-generated content is bright, and it's exciting to see how ChatGPT and BERT will continue to evolve and shape the future of content generation.